Okay, folks, I have people call me and ask me about three-phase electric 120, 208 three-phase, and 277, 483 phase and how to measure voltage and what is a high leg. I had a customer call me the other day and ask me, hey, I got one high leg. What does that mean? Where is it supposed to be? Generally speaking, according to the National Electric Code, the, the high leg has to be on the B phase of a three-phase system. I'm going to demonstrate here on this particular panel. It's not marked correctly, but we'll talk about it as I do it. I'm using my fill piece meter, which is a versatile tool both for air conditioning and electrical. I'm going to put it to volts AC, and my voltage should be more than 200, so I'm going to put it on 600 volts AC. What you want to do, first thing you want to do is take your meter and you're going to find your neutral. Okay, this here is going to be the neutral side, the ground side, so I'm going to go from here to each individual leg. So this is A phase. 121. Can you see that? Okay, I'm going to go to B phase. See how that's 208? Now I'm going to go to C phase. 122. So that tells me I have a uh, 120, 208, 3 phase system. Now this is one thing I want to point out to you. 243. 235. Okay, now I'm going to go to ground and neutral. Nothing. Okay, for you electrician out there, you're going to see this orange tape. 120, 208, 3 phase is normally black, red, and blue. I don't know who did this panel box. So I just grabbed the orange tape I just stuck on there just to show you this is the high leg. So when you go to a three-phase box, the first thing you need to do is pull out your meter and figure out which one's your high leg, the voltage on the high leg, and make sure when you hook up your compressors or you hook up your three-phase motors, you hook them up in A, B, and C phase sequence, okay? Because if you're not if you're not if you're not careful, you can actually reverse your motor or whatever you're trying to do. And some people will try to switch the A and C leg, and that's really not what you're supposed to do. Let's try to follow the National Electric Code and standards. If you have any questions on how to measure three-phase voltage, just give us a call at Jones Air Conditioning, 239-596-5855. Go to jonesairconditioning.com. If you like this, please share, please subscribe, and please comment. Thank you.